might have not filmed this, so I'm just gonna say it here, but the headers that was uh, originally on his car, because he actually drove it pretty hard with a gasket leak, so that would have just warped the um, flange of the headers. So, though Aaron like took down everything, after, um, as soon as we started the car, it started leaking from the exhaust gasket. So, Aaron actually had to redo everything, and that's why you just saw in the time lapse. Um, so, got it done. Basically, back on the dyno. Uh, just gonna fix the bracket for the. Um... Oh no, and he's already making a mess. Yeah. After we clean up everything here, he's the one that's making a mess again. Yeah. It's not gonna be in the video, don't worry. Alright, so. I was just gonna stay a little longer to just work on the Cold Park car. Uh, we have an event coming up next week, so I'm just trying to make it a little bit nicer than what it is. Just I saw the videos and stuff and didn't like the the look. I mean, I'm not, you know, the look is not what I'm going for with this, you know. Though, but you know, I'd rather just have it a little bit nicer. If it's something more functional, I'll do it. The spoiler it was on there at one point. But the double side tape that came with, um, pretty much it was kind of 50-50 chance it was going to come off on, at the, uh, the event. So I think I, that's the best bowler in my opinion for the Jazz Scoop. Just nothing crazy, just a little accent here. Um, you can see a little bit of a, like a wide body looking fender. I had to space it out to get the flare. But yeah, this part was, wasn't done right. It looks kind of ugly. And I got the uh, front bumper back on and I think it looks pretty good <clears throat> for a cool park car yes it's been missing the front bumper for a while and that's a bumper that I painted a while ago by the way uh, and see the wheel poke now kind of like it um, did a little bit of donut earlier I think it's now that the, it's got a so much grip in the front the, the steering is like kind of uh, harder to turn so I don't know how that's gonna affect on the uh, at the track. I have a local guy that has the bumper, and he told me um, I can have it. But I'll see. So <sighs> I wish this door I didn't give out to Aaron. He has that. His door is perfect, and that that's actually from this car. And just put that uh, bumper on. It will look, you know, decent. Just decent drift car. And Aaron was underneath of this car. Like with a few pulls and everything, it was over boosting. So we're just gonna go with a different spring. Earlier it was making about 10 pounds. For no reason, I let off, but. And it has a five pound spring in there. I guess that was a reason, I guess. But guess who's back? Everything is holding up. Ah, it looks good. Now what is this piece of shit? 